right, here we go. I confess to Almighty God to bless Mary, ever virgin, to bless Michael the Archangel, to bless John the Baptist, to the holy apostles Peter and Paul, and to all the saints that I have sinned. Exceedingly in thought, word, and deed, through my through my fault, through my fault, through my most grievous fault. Therefore I beseech, bless Mary, ever virgin, bless Michael the Archangel. Bless John the Baptist and the holy apostles Peter and Paul and all the saints to pray for to pray to the Lord our God for me. May Almighty God have mercy on me, forgive me my sins, and bring me to everlasting life. Amen. May the Almighty and merciful Lord grant me pardon, absolution, and remission of all my sins. Amen. Logan, yesterday we went over this. This isn't good to be laughing when I'm trying to pray. An act of faith. Oh my God, I firmly believe that you are one God in three divine persons, Father, Son, and Holy Spirit. I believe that your divine Son became man and died for our sins, and that he will come to judge the living and the dead. I believe these and all the truths which the Holy Catholic Church teaches, because you have revealed them, who can neither deceive nor be deceived. Amen. An act of hope. Oh my God, Relying on your almighty power and infinite mercy and promises, I hope to obtain pardon for my sins. The help of your grace and life everlasting. Through the merits of Jesus Christ, my Lord and Redeemer. Amen. An act of love. Oh my God, I love you above all things with my whole heart and soul, because you are all good and worthy of all love. I love my neighbor as myself for the love of you. I forgive all who have injured me and ask pardon of whom I have injured. Amen. An act of con uh, contrition. Oh my God, I am heartily sorry for having offended you, and I detest all my sins because of your just punishments, but most of all because they offend you, my God, who, who are all good and deserving of all my love. I firmly resolve with the help of your grace to sin no more and to avoid the unnecessary occasions of sin. Amen. have brought us safely to the beginning of this day defend us today by your mighty power that we may not fall into any sin but that all our words may so proceed and all our thoughts and actions be so directed as to be always just in your sight through christ our lord amen direct we beg you O lord our actions by your holy inspirations and carry them on by your gracious assistance that every prayer and work of ours may begin always with you and through you be happily ended. Amen. O oh my God, I offer you all my prayers, works, and sufferings in union with the Sacred Heart of Jesus for the intentions for which he pleads and offers himself to the holy sacrifice of the Mass in thanksgiving for your favors in reparation uh, for my offenses and in humble supplication for my temporal and eternal welfare, for the conversion of sinners and for the relief of the poor souls in purgatory. I wish to gain all the indulgences attached to the prayers I shall say and to the good works I shall perform this day. Amen. Uh, Oh my God. Oh wait, I already did that, didn't I? Yes, I did. Sorry, guys. I did that one. Okay. 
As I rise today, may the strength of God pilot me, the power of God uphold me, the wisdom of God guide me, may the eye of God look before me, the ear of God hear me, the word of God speak for me, may the hand of God protect me, the way of God lie before me, the shield of God defend me, the host of God save me, may Christ shield me today, Christ with me, Christ before me, Christ behind me. Christ in me, Christ beneath me, Christ above me, Christ on my right, Christ on my left, Christ when I lie down, Christ when I sit, Christ when I stand, Christ in the heart of everyone who thinks of me, Christ in the mouth of everyone who speaks of me, Christ in the eye of everyone who sees me, Christ in every ear that hears me. Amen. What? What is this? Isaiah. Isaiah. O oh, Divine Savior, I transport myself in spirit to Mount Calvary to ask pardon for my sins, for it was because of humankind's sins that you chose to offer yourself in sacrifice. I thank you for your ex uh, extraordinary generosity, and I am also grateful to you for making me a child of Mary, your mother. Blessed Mother, take me under your protection. Saint John, you took Mary under your care. Teach me true devotion to Mary, the Mother of God. May the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit be glorified in all places through the Immaculate Virgin Mary. Amen. O oh, Sacred Heart of Jesus, living and life-giving fountain of eternal life, infinite treasure of the divinity and glowing furnace of love, you are my refuge and my sanctuary, O oh, adorable and glorious Savior. Con uh, consume my heart with that burning fire that ever inflames your heart. Pour down on my soul those graces which flow from your love. Let my heart be so united with yours that our wills may be one, and mine may in all things be conformed to yours. May your will be the rule of both my desires and my actions. Amen. In all my temptations, I place my trust in you, O Sacred Heart of Jesus. In all my weaknesses, I place my trust in you, O Sacred Heart of Jesus. In all my difficulties, I place my trust in you, O Sacred Heart of Jesus. In all my trials, I place my trust in you, O Sacred Heart of Jesus. In all my sorrows, I place my trust in you, O Sacred Heart of Jesus. In all my works, I place my trust in you, O Sacred Heart of Jesus. In every failure, I place my trust in you, O Sacred Heart of Jesus. In every discouragement, I place my trust in you, O Sacred Heart of Jesus. In life and in death, I place my trust in you, O Sacred Heart of Jesus. In time and in eternity, I place my trust in you, O Sacred Heart of Jesus. Amen. Most sweet Jesus, Redeemer of the human race, look down upon us humbly prostrate before you. We are yours and yours we wish to be. But to be more surely united with you, behold, each one of us freely consecrates himself today to your most sacred heart. Many indeed have never known you. Many too, despising your precepts, have rejected you. Have mercy on them all, most merciful Jesus, and draw them to your sacred heart. Be king, O Lord, not only of the faithful who have never forsaken you, but also of the prodigal children who have abandoned you. Grant that they may quickly return to their father's house, lest they die of wretchedness and hunger. Be king of those who are uh, who are deceived by erroneous opinions, or whom discord keeps aloof, and call them back to the harbor of truth and the unity of faith, so that soon there may be but one flock and one shepherd. Grant, O Lord, to your church assurance of freedom and immunity from harm. Give tranquility of order to all nations. Make the earth resound from pole to pole with one cry. Praise to the divine heart that brought our salvation. To it be glory and honor forever. Amen.
Father, Son, and Holy Spirit. Amen. Queen of the Holy Rosary, you have deigned to come to Fatima to reveal to the three shepherd children the treasures of grace hidden in the rosary. Inspire my heart with a sincere love for this devotion, in order that by meditating on the mysteries of our redemption, which are recalled in it, I may be enriched with its fruits and obtain peace for the world in the conversion of sinners and of Russia, and the favor which I ask of you in this rosary. for the greater glory of God, for your own honor and for the good of souls, especially for my own. Amen. In the name of the Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. No. Now I begin the rosary. do the rosary now. In the name of the Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. I believe in God the Father Almighty, creator of heaven and earth, and in Jesus Christ, his only, his only begotten Son, our Lord, who was conceived by the Holy Spirit, born of the Virgin Mary, suffered under Pontius Pilate, was crucified, died, and was buried. He descended into hell, and on the third day he rose again from the dead. He ascended into heaven and sits at the right hand of God the Father Almighty. He shall come again to judge the living and the dead. I believe in the Holy Spirit, the Holy Catholic Church, the communion of saints, the forgiveness of sins, the resurrection of the body, and life everlasting. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, in earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace. Hail Mary, full of grace, Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. First Luminous Mystery, the Baptism of Jesus. I desire to live my baptismal promises. Think of Christ's baptism at the hands of John the Baptist when the Father called him his beloved Son, and Holy Spirit descended on him to invest him with the mission he was to carry out. Lord Jesus, we offer you this first decade to honor your baptism, and we ask of you through this mystery and through the intercession of your Holy Mother, the grace to fulfill our baptismal promises. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done in earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. First B. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Jesus arrived from Galilee and came to John at the Jordan to be baptized by him. Second B. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. John tried to dissuade him saying, Why do you come to me? I am the one who needs to be baptized by you. Third B. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. But Jesus said to him in reply, For the present, let it be thus. It is proper for us to do this, to fulfill all that, uh, that righteousness demands. Fourth B. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Then John acquiesced. Fifth B. 
Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. After Jesus had been baptized, as he came from the water, the heavens were opened. <coughs> Sixth feet. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. And he beheld the Spirit of God descending like a dove and alighting on him. Seventh feet. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. And a voice came from heaven, saying, This is my beloved Son, in whom I am well pleased. Eighth feet. These, uh, Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. These words recall the words of the Lord spoken by the prophet Isaiah about the suffering servant. This is my servant whom I uphold, my chosen one in whom I delight. Ninth feet. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. I will put my spirit in him, and he will bring justice to the nations. Last feet. The tenth feet. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. In his law, the coastlands will place their hope. This is what the Lord says. Isaiah 42, to 1 through 5. Guys, shh. Glory be to the Father, to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Jesus, at your baptism in the Jordan, the Father called you his beloved Son, and the Holy Spirit descended upon you to invest you with your mission. Help me to keep my baptismal promises. O oh my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, and lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of thy mercy. Amen. Second Luminous Mystery Christ's Self-Manifestation at Cana I desire to do whatever Jesus says. Think of Christ's self-manifestation at the wedding of Cana, when he changed water into wine and opened the hearts of the disciples to faith, thanks to the interve intervention of Mary, the first among believers. Lord Jesus, we offer you this second decade to honor your self-manifestation at the wedding feast of Cana, and we ask of you through this mystery and through Mary's intercession, the willingness to do whatever you say. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, in earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. First be, Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. On the third day, there was a wedding feast at Cana in Galilee. The mother of Jesus was there, and Jesus and his disciples had also been invited. Second B. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. When the wine was exhausted, the mother of Jesus said to him, They have no wine. Third B. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Jesus responded, Woman, what concern is this of up to us? My hour has not yet come. Fourth B. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. His mother said to the servants, Do whatever he tells you. Fifth B. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Standing nearby, there were six stone water jugs of the type used for Jewish rites of purification, each holding 20 to 30 gallons. Sixth B. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. 
Jesus instructed the servants, fill the jars with water. Seventh B. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. When they had filled them to the brim, he ordered them, Now draw some out and take it to the chief steward. And they did so. Eighth B. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. When the chief steward had tasted the water that had become wine, he did not know where it came from, although the servants who had drawn the water knew. Ninth B. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. The chief steward called over the bridegroom and said, Everyone serves the choice wine first, and then an inferior vintage when the guests have had too much to drink. However, you have saved the best wine until now. Last be the tenth be. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Jesus performed this, the first of his signs at Cana in Galilee, thereby revealing his glory and his disciples believed in him. Glory be to the Father, to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, the world without end. Amen. Mary, the first among believers in Christ, as a result of your intercession at Cana, your son changed water into wine and opened the hearts of the disciples to faith. Obtain for me the grace to do whatever Jesus says. O oh, my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, and lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of thy mercy. Amen. Third luminous mystery, Christ's proclamation of the kingdom of God. I desire God's forgiveness. Think of Christ's uh, preaching of the kingdom of God with its call to forgiveness as he inaugurated the ministry of mercy, which he continues to exercise until the end of the world, until the end of the world, particularly through reconciliation. Lord Jesus, we offer you this third decade to honor your proclamation of the kingdom of God, and we ask of you through this mystery and through the intercession of your holy mother, the pardon of all our sins. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, in earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. First B. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Jesus said, The time of fulfillment has arrived, and the kingdom of God is close at hand. Repent and believe in the gospel. Guys, why don't you draw or do something so that you're not making noise in the background? That would be great. Second B. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Uh, later he gave them the eight beatitudes. Blessed are the poor in spirit, for theirs is the kingdom of heaven. Third B. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Blessed are those who mourn, for they will be con uh, uh, com comforted. Fourth B. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Blessed are the meek, for they will inherit the earth. Fifth B. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Blessed are those who hunger and thirst for justice, for they will have their fill. Sixth B. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Blessed are the merciful, for they will obtain mercy. Seventh B. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Blessed are the pure of heart, for they will see God. 
18. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Blessed are the peacemakers, for they will be called children of God. Lucas, stop making loud noises, please. Ninth B. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Blessed are those who are persecuted in the cause of justice, for theirs is the kingdom of heaven. Guys, please stop making noise in the background. I'm trying to concentrate. Tenth and the last bead. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Blessed are you when people insult you and persecute you and utter all kinds of calamities against you for my sake. Rejoice and be glad, for your reward will be great in heaven. Glory be to the Father, to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Jesus, you preach the kingdom of God uh, with its call to forgiveness, inaugurating the, min the ministry of mercy, which you continue to exercise, especially through the sacrament of reconciliation. Help me to seek forgiveness for my sins. Oh, my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, and lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of thy mercy. Amen. Fourth Luminous Mystery, The Transfiguration. I desire to be a new person in Christ. Think of Christ's uh, transfiguration when the glory of the Godhead shone forth from his face as the Father commanded the apostles to listen to him and experience his passion and resurrection and be transfigured by the Holy Spirit. Lord Jesus, we offer you this fourth decade to honor your transfiguration, and we ask of you through this mystery and through the intercession of your Holy Mother, the firm desire to become new persons. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done in earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our, uh, forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. First be, Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Six days later, Jesus took Peter and James and his brother John with him and led them up to a high mountain by themselves. Second be, Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. And in their presence, in their presence he was transfigured. His face shone like the sun, and his clothes became dazzling white. Third B. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Suddenly there appeared to them Moses and Elijah conversing with him. Fourth B. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Then Peter said to Jesus, Lord, it is good for us to be here. Fifth B. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. If you wish, I will make three tents here, one for you, one for Moses, and one for Elijah. Sixth B. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. While he was speaking, suddenly a bright cloud cast a shadow over them. Seventh B. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Then a voice from the cloud said, This is my beloved Son, with whom I am well pleased. Listen to him. Eighth B. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. When the disciples heard this, they fell on their faces and were greatly frightened. Eighth B. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Oh, ninth B, sorry. Ninth B. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. But Jesus came and touched them, saying, Stand up and do not be frightened. 
last beat, the tenth beat. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. And when they raised their eyes, they saw no one but only Jesus. Glory be to the Father, to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Jesus, at your transfiguration, the glory of the Godhead shone forth from your face, as the Father commanded the apostles to hear you and be transfigured by the Holy Spirit. Help me to be a new person in you. Oh, my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, and lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of thy mercy. Amen. Fifth Luminous Mystery, the institution of the Eucharist. I desire active, particip I desire active participation at Mass. Think of Christ's uh, institution of the Eucharist, in which he offered his body and blood as food and drink under the signs of bread and wine and testified to his love for humanity. For, for whose sake he would uh, offer himself in sacrifice. Lord Jesus, we offer you this fifth decade to honor the mystery of the institution of the Eucharist, and we ask of you, through this mystery and through the intercession of your Holy Mother, the desire to act uh, to achieve active participation at every Mass. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, in earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. First beat. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. The day of the Feast of Unleavened Bread arrived, and on which the Passover lamb had to be sacrificed. Second beat. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Jesus sent Peter and John, saying, Go and make preparations for us to eat the Passover. Third beat. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. When the hour came, Jesus took his place at the table along with the apostles. Fourth beat. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. He said to them, I have eagerly desired to eat this Passover with you before I suffer. Fifth bead. Hail Mary, full of grace, Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. For I tell you that from this moment on, I shall never eat it again until it is fulfilled in the kingdom of God. Guys, please don't do that when I'm trying to read. Sixth bead. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Then he took the cup, and after giving thanks, he said, Take this and divide it among your, uh, yourselves. Seventh bead. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. For I tell you that from this moment I will not drink of the fruit of the vine until the kingdom of God comes. Eighth beat. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Then he took bread, and after giving thanks, he broke it and gave it to them, saying, This is my body, which will be given for you. Ninth beat. Hail Mary, full of grace, uh, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Do this in memory of me. Last be the tenth be. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. And he did the same with the cup after supper, saying, This cup is the new covenant in my blood, which will be poured out for you.
Glory be to the Father, to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Jesus, at the Last Supper, you instituted the Eucharist, offering the signs of bread and wine, and testifying to your love for humanity. Help me to attain active participation at every Mass. O oh, my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, and lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of thy mercy. Amen. Hail, Holy Queen, Mother of Mercy, our life, our sweetness, and our hope. To thee do we cry, poor banished children of Eve. To thee do we send up our sighs, mourning and weeping in this valley of tears. Turn then, most gracious advocate, thine eyes of mercy toward us, and after this our exile. Show unto us the blessed fruit of thy womb, Jesus. O clement, O loving, O sweet Virgin Mary, pray for us, O Holy Mother of God, that we may be made worthy of the promises of Christ. Amen. O God, whose only begotten Son, uh, by his life, death, and resurrection, has purchased for us the rewards of eternal life, grant we beseech thee that by meditating upon these mysteries of the Most Holy Rosary of the Blessed Virgin Mary, we may imitate what they contain and obtain what they promise through the same Christ, our Lord. Amen. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done in earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. And amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Remember, O most blessed Virgin Mary, that never was it known that anyone who fled to your protection, implored your help, or sought your intercession was left unaided. Inspired by this confidence, we fly unto thee, O Virgin of Virgins, our Mother. To you do we come before you we stand, sinful and sorrowful. O Mother of the Word incarnate, despise not our petitions, but in your mercy hear and answer them. Amen. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Now we start school. Open your workbooks to today's uh, lesson. Mm -hmm. Mm Just before the uh, Christmas break that we took from um, <clears throat> uh, Chisley uh, to Tibet, uh, we didn't get to finish one of the lessons just before the Christmas holiday. So um, we had to continue from where we left off in the middle of a lesson and uh, so that's why we're doing only a half a lesson today. Um, yesterday we got through a whole rosary, which was good, but also took forever. It literally took us five hours to get through one rosary. Uh, and that's because it's just really difficult for the boys to come back after, um, you know, the Christmas holiday and starting up school again. 
<laughs> like we were supposed to begin on Monday, but we had misplaced a lot of our school supplies. So we had to look for the school supplies. So we didn't even get to do school on Monday. Uh, Tuesday, uh, we were still looking for school supplies. And um, so yesterday, Wednesday, uh, in the Gregorian calendar was the day that we got to actually start trying to do school and we didn't even get through the rosary. So I set up a new system now that uh, during this period of time where we're doing the longer version of the rosary, I will say the rosary while they listen and highlight the scriptures for the mystery of that rosary. So that's what we were doing today, the boys wrote down um they highlighted while i did uh the um rosary and then afterwards they colored and they just listened to the rosary and yeah so um tomorrow i'm thinking i'm gonna have them a little more interactive uh when we're supposed to say amen i'm gonna have them say amen so that they're following along at least and yeah so today was not that bad it was better uh, than yesterday at least we got through the lessons that we were supposed to get through they're supposed to be reading their uh, homework reading which is um, extra reading at the end of each lesson in the catechism it gives you a list of scriptures to ponder on so they should be doing those right now I don't know if they are because currently I'm in here uh, voicing over to explain the day and yeah, I just, I feel like we're doing a lot more now than we ever were doing before. Um, and I feel like uh, the boys are really grasping the intention and the and the work that we're doing together. Like the, the homework and the lesson itself is really retaining in them, I find, because they are answering each question as I write it out, I ask them the question afterward, and then I write down their answer. And if they're wrong, I, I correct them and I just say simply, no, try again. And then they try again. And then if they get it wrong again, I give them one last chance. And if they get it wrong again, then I tell them the answer. And then they're like, oh, right, that's right. We just read that. Yes, yes, we did just read that. And so, yeah, and um, they were a little fussy about how long one of the questions was but I had to explain that this is essential for them for their uh, catechism because they need to know their faith to be baptized they need to know exactly what they're being baptized into so they have to understand what we're do what the faith is what we're supposed to do after we're we're baptized what our baptismal promises are and what they mean so this is the most important part of the whole entire thing and i really need them to focus and understand why we're doing the catechism the way we're doing the catechism and we're just focusing on the catechism right now because of this and honestly i think that that's basically going to be our schooling for the next couple of years is the catechism because i have enough work for us to do for two three four years um quite literally uh we're only on what lesson um what are we on we're on lesson seven tomorrow and uh there's like over like uh, I don't know I have like the bigger catechism I did the smaller catechism for the kids but we're gonna do the bigger one afterward and in the bigger one let's just see in the bigger catechism there is holy there's like a bunch there's I'll just put it into perspective for you there are 823 pages in this bigger larger catechism and I'm probably not going to be having them do all of this but the most important parts of this they will have to do I'll leave out like fluffy stuff that they don't need to know like um I don't know like 
just random stuff on the side kind of thing but i will stick to the lessons that they need to actually know and um they don't really i don't i haven't seen them really explain in the children's catechism the sacraments in great detail where in the bigger catechism for adults it's outlined very detailed so i might have to use the bigger catechism for that we also have three other catechism books that are specific to not just the baptism but also the first communion and reconciliation which are some of the sacraments and um yeah uh then there's the bigger version of it um which is a bigger book and i think that they'll really enjoy that too and yes we're still doing other things other than that we're not just doing catechism we're also doing still learning how to read and write in japanese we're still learning japanese and we're doing english spelling uh, punctuation grammar reading and writing and we're also doing math still um we're going to be going into history very shortly about the end of the gregorian calendar month of january which would be our i think it's shabet is our next um month in the biblical months of the year shabet is next so we'll be beginning in shabet on history and we're going to be going over the very first church fathers after jesus's resurrection who the apostles taught specifically we're going to be going into great detail and we're going to be going over popes and uh, the vatican councils and things of this nature we're going to be going over the things that they'll hear in the world like constantine started the church absolutely incorrect we'll be going over the correct doctrine and the actual history of it uh we'll be going over the um 10 plagues of egypt and their uh representations uh for wiping out any kind of pagan god uh there's a whole description I'll, I'll post the picture in here so you can see that um and yeah so it's just going to be really really amazing the things that we're going to be doing for history we're going to be using a lot of the catechism for the history as well because there's a lot of history and tradition in the catechism we're going to be using the bible of course because that's where we get most of our history and our doctrine and it is profitable to learn and teach from so we'll be using that to learn and teach from and uh <clears throat> we're also learning uh the songs that we sing weekly at mass um like the ave maria uh and um what was the other one uh holy 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 um uh there's so many that were that were we've got listed um even like seasonal ones that we sing during uh christmas christmas time and lent and um yeah we like alleluia um there's so many that we're trying to learn right now it's it's been a trip and we listen to them each morning right after rosary and prayers we listen to the catholic hymnals so that we can learn them and um we also have certain prayers that we're supposed to learn uh like the the confession we have to make a confession each day of our sins to god and repent and ask for mercy and forgiveness which is a good tool and a good teaching for the boys to learn that they need to be sorry and feel sorry for the things that they do wrong. And they learned today the difference between mortal and venial sin. Now, little children usually only commit venial sin, but those venial sins can turn into mortal sins as they get older because 
they have a snowball effect, which we discussed today. And I'm very glad that they asked me why I said snowball during one of the answers. And I said, because when you roll a small little ball of snow on snow, it gets bigger and bigger and bigger, which is called the snowball effect. And they understand completely what I was saying. And I was really happy about that. So as you can see here, I'm asking them the questions and they're giving me the answers and I'm writing down the answer exactly how they said it. And they're actually very, very, um, they're, they're learning. They're learning very well. I, I'm surprised. And um, I'm very impressed by their intellectual uh, fervor and they are doing very well in school. I'm, I'm surprised even we, even though we had like a hiccup the first couple of days of the week, but you know, they're doing much better now. And I'm very, very, very impressed with their work ethic on their um, <clears throat> remembering and learning and helping me remember when I forget something I said, <laughs> uh, which is what Lucas was just doing. He was helping me. I was like, I can't remember, Lucas. Can you help me? And he's like, you said blah, blah, blah. And I'm like, oh, yes, 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 yes. That's right. Thank you, Lucas. And um, it's just, it's been really, really amazing to see how they can remember things that I forget because my brain is running like a mile a minute. I was also doing dinner at the same time as the ending of the lessons for today. Like right here, I started dinner at discussion questions and then I was trying to finish up dinner when we were doing fill in the blanks. So that was when I was just finishing up dinner. So I was running around cleaning, doing things in between like I always do just to keep up with um, everything around the house. And uh, I'm just really, really proud of the boys for getting their school done today. I know it was a rough day and it was really, really, everybody was cranky, but we got it done. And I'm so happy because now we don't have to try again tomorrow. We can start on a new lesson tomorrow. And, um, oh yeah, they wanted to do their worksheets tonight, so I'll give them their worksheets right after I'm done in here on this. And I'm going to have a background song so that you guys understand what I mean by Ave Maria. I'm going to see if they have it in my video editor, and I'll have it playing in the background so that you can hear the melody of Ave Maria. And, um, yeah. And then... At the end, we did say our goodbye song and our Pioneer Club song like we always do at the end of class. And the boys had lots of fun uh, doing that, as you will hear clearly. And uh, as we continue on with our learning and developing our school days as we're coming back from the Christmas holiday, uh, you'll see that things will be getting a little more... Um, routine again and back into the rhythm and the groove of things that was a little out of whack before but now is working back and getting back into what we were doing before with that being said i hope everybody had a wonderful christmas and our christmas in the catholic church runs until the presentation which is february 2nd and i cannot wait until our baptism and you guys will be seeing a lot of those videos coming out later oh um by the way i forgot i i was going to do a video before i post or i could just post this one and then do the video um anyone who's watching this will probably realize that what are you talking about are you converting to catholicism yes everyone on youtube that follows me i'm converting to catholicism I know many of you didn't know that and um and it was a very very well thought out um uh thing it wasn't like a on a whim i literally prayed about it and i searched the lord for answers of whether this was for me or not and i will explain that testimony in my video that i will put out after this one explaining why I'm choosing to convert to Catholicism and I hope that you have love in your heart for my decision and not just contempt for my decision 
I am not brainwashed. I, I'm not lost. I'm not confused. I am actually much more uh, understand. I'm, I'm understanding a lot more than I did as a Protestant. So with that being said, I will end this now and I'll let you guys uh, watch my video that will be coming after this. It's probably going to be a long one because I have to explain things and I'm going to be posting some stuff in there so it's going to be a little bit of a documentary style kind of video so i hope that everybody had a wonderful holiday i love you all and i will catch you in the next video love you all later for now bye bye Mwah. Pioneer song. Ready? Yeah. One, two, three. We are pioneers for Jesus. We are looking on to him. We believe his word and we trust the Lord with a faith that will not dim. And we will tell the world about our Savior. His wondrous grace proclaim. So let the praises ring and loud the voices sing until we find his name, Jesus! Very good. <laughs>